There we go. On. What's up, guys? Shroom on the river today on the Georges River. It's a smashing day. The weather is fantastic. It's really sunny. That's not going to stop me. Look how high the sun is up right up there behind me. I think you should be able to see it somewhere there anyway. So not ideal conditions, but who cares? We're fishing today and that's what we're going to do. We're going to be chasing some brim. Let's get going. Right in there. That was on, on, on the drop. There's two poles here. Oh yes, I think I, no, no, it's in there somewhere. Uh, yep, it's out, it's out. There it is, there it is. Wow, that was right up against the bank. Had to push that one all the way in for that hookup. Can you guys see it? it's coming up now? Look at that, just keep it away from the snags. There he is. There he is. There he is. There he is. Let me just put my bags down. All right, guys, got the net in my hand. Here he comes. Here he comes now. Oh, need to need to get a, get a, need to get another wind on. Boom, there we go. Nice little Brembo. All right, not too little, legal, nice legal. Pick him up for you. All right guys, he's just about the Z-Man grub right here. Luckily I kept pressure on and used the net. Here we are. Nice little Brembo guys. Let's let him go. To the water's edge, see you later mate, slip you in right there. Right guys, I was just saying, I was just saying while I had this next cast that I just saw a brim swim across from me and it looked pretty decent. Wow, what's that? Something stirred up those mullet. I can see the mullet. I cannot see anything behind it though. All right, they're turning quickly. Someone's rounding them up, whatever it is, I can't see. But the mullet definitely are spooked by something there on the, on the right. And then they turned back around. So just keep an eye on that. Wow, what was that? What kind of commotion was that, guys? What do you guys reckon it was? That spooked the mullet. I'm sure that showed up on the camera there. That was just right over here. They look like pretty big mullet too, about 20 centimeters or larger. Uh, I don't know what to say. Keep an eye on that today. So if you can get it all the way in there, you'll get a fish. If you can get it all the way in there, that's a hard cast. Not good enough still. Yeah, it won't be here too long, so let's just buy one. Yeah, that's good. Decent. Alright, that's it. We're done. We're done here. Good cast. Watch if I get hit, I'm gonna get pulled into the right, into the mangroves. But we're not gonna let that happen because I'm gonna go hard. Come on, Brim. I reckon there's at least one of you guys in there. There we go, oh no. It took it just on the second last hop. I was just about to go for it again and it picked it up off the bottom. That was off the bottom, guys. That was not on the drop, that was off the bottom. Look at that. See the proof right there. And of course, the reel started running. I mean, the drag started screaming a bit. 
twitching a bit. I mean, started chirping a little bit there. Just getting it back out there. I don't think it's going to come back. I've had my chance, I think. What happens when you fish these snags? You get one chance, pretty much. It felt the hooks because it was pulling line. Pulling line, pretty good line too. It wasn't like a little tap and then drop. It was more like a saw it off the bottom, waited till it hit the bottom again, and then it just picked it up and ran. Pick and run, as I call it. There we go, on. Oh, no. Yes, got him out of there. Gotcha, you little rascal. I had to keep the rod tip down. Ho, 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 another one. Let's keep him on the top. There's too much snags here. Might pull the hook, but I've got to keep it on the top. Wow. Don't think that one's coming off, so we're just going to go hoist him up. Three, two, one. There we go. Number two for the day. Two for the shroom again. Look how dark this one is. I wonder if this was the same one that just hit me that guys that was exciting I had to keep quiet for a second because I thought my time there was um, a dusting was due <laughs> luckily I don't know how kept it out of there wow all right so we're gonna have to get that hook out check that brim out guys so good right there inside Right there inside on the corner, almost got me on the snag. Let's let it go. All right, it's managed to unhook itself. See you later, mate. Back in the water. Other way, mate. See you later. Goodbye. Oh, later. Over here. There's obviously fish here. It's hard to fish though. Let's just pass it out there. And just see what happens. Very interesting. I'll I'll I'll, let, I'll loosen the drag. I want it to run out. So nothing there. Oh. Oh. Still on the walk, guys. Just walking gap to gap, just walking around, finding the next um. Finding the next promising spot. Whew. It's really hot though. Don't know whether it was a bird or... Could have been the bird. It did cross my line at some stage. There we go, that was a good hit. Is it coming back for seconds though? Don't think so, I'm just gonna let it rest there. Changing it up. They don't seem to be coming back on the second hit, so just pause it for a moment. All right, lift, blow one. No, they certainly don't wanna come back for the second. Ah, snag that time. Might explain why entrenched in the snag the first time was good Cert certified hit that one just out across again this time I pushed it all the way to the bank the bold cast that one asking for trouble but asking for a fish too <laughs> oh there's a bit of weed there I just felt that that was a bit of soft soft snaggy material no hit yet this time no I'll get around that tree that's a given now I don't know whether I can catch another fish out of here I think that might be it but we'll just, just have another cast and just fucking see. Oh yes! On! On the drop! Oh, big head shakes! 
big head shakes. Whoa, look at that. That rod tip is getting thrown around. That's no brim, guys. That's a flatty. That's why. Look at that. I've got to keep its head below the water. I don't know what I was doing there. Keep it low. Wow. Shocker. Shocking head shakes. All right, here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. He's not happy. He is not happy. Let's get that net, huh? I think my uh, leader might be a bit dodge. This one's not a bad one. Not a bad, bad flatty here. These head shakes are crazy. Look at that. Still doesn't want to come up. Net's over here. All right, I can see the lure now on the corner. All right, didn't like the look of the net there. All right, come back around, buddy. All right, keep his head low. One-handed net job, so difficult. No, got to wait till the head comes around this way. Look at that, that is so nice. That flatty. Oh my gosh. There we are. Woo. Hey, not a bad flatty this one. Check that out. It's pretty big. Probably looking at 50. Or at least, at least high 40s I'd say. Check it out guys. Check out that flatty. Hooks right in there. Let's get it out for you mate. Get it up for you, mate. Jeez, uh, what's that? How'd that get on there? What's all this? All these cicada shells. All right, get that pop. Oh, it's got a pretty big head. Pop, pop. There it is. Z-Man grub, watermelon. Sorry, motor oil. Let's get that out of there. There's a fish. All right, guys, check out that fish there. Excellent. Excellent catch. Really happy with this one. Let's let it go. All right, here we are. We're gonna let it go down here. I'm gonna slip it into the water. There you go, buddy. See you later. Off you go. <laughs> I tell you what, that was a that was a really satisfying catch. What a flathead! Wasn't expecting that. Those head shakes. Whew, so good. One more thing guys, I've been grinding for that fish for probably for the last um, hour and a half, hour and a half, maybe even two hours now without without any success. So so it's not always, yeah, so it, it's not always easy. Um, had to persevere, definitely had to persevere for that flathead, but you know, great results so far. Best way to do this is to just get in there and have a look. Have a look. Not too good. There could be freaking snakes here. You know what, we'll give this a pass. I don't want to go too deep into the grass. I'm gonna freaking end up getting bitten by a snake. Holy shite, look at that snake, buddy. Look at that snake there. Red belly black. Guys, hit the like button. <laughs> Holy. G'day, mates. Red belly black, I just, um, what, what, oh, there it is, there it is, there it is. Going towards there. I'm not trying to chase it, I'm just walking along the path here. That's insane. Make sure that's the same one. Holy, let's go. And yep, I think what I'm gonna do now is I'm not gonna be bush bashing so deep into the bush behind me. That's a sign to stop going so thick into the bush as you can see on my side here. We're not gonna be going in deep anymore. It's really hot, obviously there are snakes, but and uh, yeah, I'm being, I'm being careful, but I think that's just a sign to kind of stay clear now. So that's what we're gonna do. All right, so we're gonna do a little bit of bush bashing. Looks like a 
nice clear path. Let's just stamp my way through to the water. If there's any snakes, I'll wake them up. No, okay, so unfishable. All right, so we're not gonna try, let's go back. Let's get it done, guys. Just drop down my bags. This isn't too bad. Don't think I'm gonna come across a snake here. Looks pretty safe. I just gotta get it out about seven meters, but I can cast further than that. So let's have a go. We'll get close if we get hits. <laughs> oh, so there's definitely snags, but there we go. Ooh, hits, yep. All right, we're getting closer, guys. We are getting closer. While I fix this pantsing, I'll get just a few steps closer. Where is it? Okay, this is a good edge. We'll stand here. I think any further, and that's the water where the reeds are. So, no closer than that. Let's wait for this wind. So I don't... There we go. Quick, flat cast. Pick up some reeds. No, not this time. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Go, do it, do it, do it, do it. Take it, take it, take it. Oh my gosh. I'll leave, I'm leaving it in there. They're hitting it. Oh, they're hitting it. They're hitting the lure. They're hitting the lure. Let's try to the right a bit. My gosh. Rarely does it catch like that on the reeds. But we have... Are you kidding me? That actually snapped. Yeah, we'll keep moving. This is um, not ideal. I honestly don't see a way to cross it. Set barrel in into there. I mean, wasp nest. There's a wasp nest there. Let's get out of here. That's too close. Super skinny water, but nothing there. Back on the path. All right, this is risky. All right. So you need a shorter rod. I think my rod's a bit too long here. How am I going to get in for a cast? So we're going to cast out that way real quiet. Skip it. Yep. No, nothing. All right. Nothing here either. All right, guys, looks like we've come to the end of the river here. This is the end. I can see water there. That's where we came from on the right hand side. There's some fresh flowing down. But other than that, that's the end as far as I'm concerned. Probably a few pools to the left, but that's it. You now, what we're going to do, we're just going to have one quick cast out this way. Yep, just around that tree branch. I don't know how I'm going to land it, but let's hook up first. <laughs> what was that? Oh, good hit. There we go again. Yep, got him. Got him. Got him. Yep, lift him up. Yes, 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 yes. Look how high up I am. Three meters up off, off the bank. Oh, getting, getting water all over, my, all over my mouth. Thank you, mate. Look at that crud in the water. I don't want that on me. <laughs> oh. Spiky, dark upper George's River brim. Whoa. Here we are, ladies and gents. The little brim on the Motor Royal Z Man Grub 116th ounce jig head. Size 2. Can't beat it. Right, let's get that pop in the corner. Easy does it. Boop. Out it comes. There's the lure. Let's throw ye little fish back. Back in the water out that way. See you later, mates. Big flop. Look at that, raindrops. And with that, that's the end of my session, guys. Thanks for joining me this week. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's time I got out of here. If you guys want to see more content, I'm going to put up a couple of videos up right now. And thanks for all your support as always, and I'll catch you in the next video.